Hey guys, welcome to Math in 60 Seconds. Today we're going to be talking about systems of equations in 60 seconds. Let's give it a shot here. Alright, real quickly, systems of equations just means that you have two or more equations. And you have to get answers for both variables. Now, there's a lot of different ways to do this, but today we're going to pick out the easiest one. So hopefully if you're stuck on your homework, you can get these done and get them out of the way. Alright, what we want to happen is we want that if we were to add up these two equations, that one of the variables would cancel out. Um, here I'm going to make the x's cancel out. So pretend to me for one second, what if instead of a 3, if that was a negative 6? Well, if we added those together, those two would cancel out. Now remember, that was not a negative 6, that was actually a 3. But what would I have to multiply that by to make it a negative 6? Well, hopefully you're saying negative 2 there, so we're going to do that. Multiply the whole thing times negative 2. Negative 2 times 3x gives us negative 6x. Negative 2 times negative 5 gives us positive 10y. And negative 2 times 14 gives us negative 28. All right, now we're going to add these two equations together here. The 6x's cancel out like we wanted. That would give us 12y. And that would give us negative 24. Now we're just going to solve for y by dividing by 12 and dividing by 12. So y equals negative 2. All right, to get your x, all you have to do is take your y and plug it back in to either one of those equations you started with. And you can really easily solve for your x. All right, thanks guys for joining us in Math in 60 Seconds. I'll see you again very soon.